Hello everyone, welcome to The Council. This is a new Episodics format game, story focused, similar vein to the Telltale style ones. Uh, the save slot is empty. Wonderful. Use a golden elixir to remove your negative alterations. Well, I'm sure we'll find out what that means. France. Paris. 19... no, not 19. I can read. 1792. Ah! Stop! You're not getting anywhere with this von Borchert. You know, I kind of get the same feeling, my dear Sarah. Now... Listen. I was warned that the facial animations may not be top <laughs> tier. <laughs> No one's coming to save you. <laughs> However, That's what you think the it is supposed order to be very good. Exactly where we are. <laughs> the Golden Order. By the time your ridiculous secret society turns up, I'll be long gone. As for you, nothing will remain of your body. If you touch All right, a you bald bastard. Head, skin you alive. You know, Louis, I have no intention of beating your dear mother. There are more persuasive ways of making you talk. Here. Yeah. What do you have in mind? You've stolen something from me that I intend to get back. Where have you hidden it? Von Borchert, you can't sell that book on the black market anymore. This is finished. Some book he wants. Okay. We know you're planning on selling it at one of Lord Mortimer's parties. All right? Just tell us who the buyer is and we can make a deal. You've no idea of the trouble you've gotten yourselves into. All right, Mr. Cliché. <laughs> oh, but you will tell me where it's hidden. I can promise you that. I doubt it somehow. <sighs> oh, stop annoying our host, Louis. Son, didn't what happened to you in Rome teach you anything? Intense flashback to Rome. Minutes and my concoction will be ready. With this, your bodies will dissolve in less than four hours. Ah. You'll see. It loosens tongues in no time. Wait, are you making us drink it? Because once we've you drunk know, it, why would we talk if we're just going to die anyway? Mother. The only hmm. thing you've ever taught me is that damn motto of yours. Always remain rational. I've opened the shackles. Draw him over here. <laughs> I'll take care of him. Von Borchardt. Von Borchardt. Mm -hmm. Listen. Let's make a deal. I'll tell you where the book is if you let my mother go free. Oh, what are you playing at? Don't worry, mother. You want to play the hero. Pity you're not in any position to do so. <laughs> yeah, that is a shame. For the last time. Where is Alazif? Let me do this. Trust me. Oh. Act or trust her. No additional information on what will happen, just the choice. Um. Well, I mean, can probably trust Mumsy, dear. Please. Trait unlocked. Mother. Trusting. Yeah, you really fucked that one up, didn't you? <laughs> wow. Well done, Louis. You reacted perfectly. What an absolute tool feel, that dude is. Couldn't be better. Let me advance slowly alive, towards the woman with so the I gun. Question him after we get back. And ignore the other dude. Pity he's just a middleman. Hmm. Means I haven't finished with this case. Oh, I had a feeling you'd be running off on one of your adventures again, Mother. You know what? I'm warning you. This time, I'm coming with you. No. Even though you impress me more and more, I have to do this on my own. Mother, you're no spring chicken anymore. <laughs> All right. Come on, let's go home. And don't forget to send our men to tend to Von Borchardt. Our men. So we uh, run some kind of detective thing then? Wonder what information was in the book that he wants 
Read letters from or never mind. One month later, okay. 1793 now. Lord Mortimer's Island, off the coast of England. He was the one that uh, law uh, that von Borchett was going to be trying to sell the book at one of Lord Mortimer's parties. I think they said a game by Big Bad Wolf Studio. I feel like there are better names to name your studio. Well done, mother. You just had to pick up Von Burchard's trail on your own, didn't you? You ditch me in Paris with no explanation, and off you go to infiltrate one of the world-renowned receptions of this Lord Mortimer, and now he writes me to say that you've gone missing on his private island? Which, by the way, looks more like a big rock than a paradise island. The Council. Episode 1, the mad one. So yeah, I believe there will be five episodes of this. This is the first game episodic game that I'll actually be playing as it releases. I've done Life is the Strange and The Walking is Dead, to but how he managed to after the fact. In any case, it is time for you to stop all this, Mother. It no longer suits your age. Well, I'm sure I'll find you once again, slogging through the caves beneath the island, searching for some long-lost oh, mystical oh, object that you just can't live without. I'm already hating this trip, and all I've done is well, think good. about it. <laughs> okay. What one may be able to imagine. It was not the host himself who invited me. Well now, Duchess. We find ourselves both invited by Sir Hall. Well, how very amusing. Perhaps we have some common interests, Your Eminence. Is this your first time at one of Lord Mortimer's legendary parties? Oh, no. We have been friends since long ago. But as I'm doing some business with Sir Holm, the invitation came from him. Well, I simply Sir can't wait Holm? for all the festivities okay. to begin. I'll, I'll be one to remember. Sir. What brings you here? Uh, hmm. Business with Lord Mortimer, or personal reason? Um... I mean, they may as well know, I guess. Probably no harm in it. Your eminence, with all due respect, I prefer to keep my reasons for coming here to myself. Oh, okay. I assume that by clicking personal reason I'd be like, yeah, I'm here to look for my mum. appear to be preparing for. I believe what you will, my son. However, everything is related to the legendary parties organized by our host. Yeah, I'll be the judge of that, Cardinal. Anyway, consider yourself fortunate, young man. Because Gosh, she must be freezing with the of simply one day whole back of her dress on gone. Island. And only a very few ever make it. Indeed, I imagine this must be your first time here. Uh, turn the question back to the Duchess. Or oh, absolutely. I mean, I think this is my first time here. Wow, okay, just had to cut that out. I just... Had a coughing fit out of nowhere. Okay, where was I? Um, let's see what the Duchess has to say. And you, Duchess? You seem to be quite accustomed to things here. Am I right? I do not think that one can ever get accustomed to what Lord Mortimer prepares for his guests. But you are right. This is not the first time I've been on this wharf. If you've come back again, I imagine you must find it to be of some interest. Here, everything is possible if you make the right choices. <laughs> it really is up to you whether you leave That's a very meta comment. Or not. Please excuse me if you find me overly curious, young man. I did not mean to cause you any embarrassment. Come, Duchess. I mean, they are waiting for us. I don't think anything when was said that was embarrassing. Duchet, What's that? If you would like to join us. I'm Monsieur coming, Duchess. De Richet. A cardinal, a duchess. I wonder if all the guests here are this prestigious. If I'd known, I, I would have gone for a better suit. Uh, Are you alright? You okay? Someone drugged you already? Oh, shit, um, 
So? Okay. Okay, it's done. Did you put it in a safe place? Yes. I made sure no one was following me. Don't worry, Sarah, no one's going to find it. Are you absolutely sure? Yes, I'm sure. Right. Just one thing left to no, do. No, mother, don't, don't! What? Have you lost your mind? There's no other way. If you, if you kill me, you won't find it. That is the point, my dear. No one must ever put their hands on it again. No. But I trusted you. Whoops. No, sir. Don't. No. Who are you? No! <gasps> you can run if you want to, Sarah. But you will pay for it. You, will, you can run if you want to, Sarah, but you'll pay for what you've done. I think he said you. that. Uh, Louis, so I guess right? that was a flash forward? What's going on? Ah, the classic nosebleed. Here, take this. Hmm. I'm sorry. Keep it. Are you better? I'm fine. Don't worry. Well, on the plus side, it's that means <laughs> Mummy Dearest is alive. Catch up with you, okay? Are you on the sure? downside, yes. She's lost I'm a sorry. hand. I'm sure. Yes. Fine. I definitely have to find mother quickly. Am I going crazy or right stick what? camera? Let's stick the move. Yep. The Emily's handkerchief. Survive with me. What's happening to me? For God's sake. Absolutely need to find you, mother. Okay. Anything back here? Doesn't seem like it. What have we got in the menus? Uh, nope, I don't want to return to the main menu. Uh, okay, never mind. It doesn't look like we do have anything in the menus. Can't read any of the letters. Okay. Let us move on then. Can I run? Oh, yes, I can. Happy days. Louis, during the trip, I had something I wanted to ask you, but we didn't happen to run into each other. Yes, Duchess? The I'm trip. I'm not sure if you remember, but we've met before. At that time, you were of two minds as to your choice of career. Were we not Tell in a me, tiny little boat when we arrived? Six. Like, sat next to each other? Oh, choose your class. Hello. This is where it starts to differentiate itself from other telltale style games uh, choosing a class defines your basic skills the other skills will still be available but unlocking them will be more expensive okay so we've got diplomat the diplomat shines in society a talented speaker he avoids faux pas and he can convince those with whom he is talking without offending them po politics is his field of predilection occultist the occultist is a master of deception convinced of the importance of not of the importance of knowledge, he has acquired extensive expertise in science and the arts. Using others to achieve his own ends does not bother him. Or detective, the detective excels in investigation. He is trained to notice every detail in his surroundings as well as in people he questions. A hands-on man, he does not shy away from the direct approach. Okay, and when we hovered over... Skills. Politics, etiquette, linguistics, conviction, diversion. Manipulation, occultism. I mean, I guess, occultist, occultism. Erudition. Uh, <laughs> gonna have to educate myself on that one after the game, because I've got no clue what that is. Science sciences, subterfuges. And questioning, vigilance, psychology, agility, logic. Okay, well. I mean, I'm not personally, like, all about the occult. In real life. That's not me, so let's ignore that one. So it's down to diplomat or detective. Um, I mean, there's going to be a lot of talking, obviously. It's a dialogue story type game, so I feel like Diplomat is probably the way to go. Uh, oh, right, view skills. Okay, so it doesn't immediately uh, choose it. So what have we got here? Diplomat unlocks. Yep, those. You now have seven effort points to use your skills. Your past has granted you a skill in manipulation and a skill in psychology. Okay. Ah, okay. So... 
Yeah, okay, so it looks like we can... Oh yeah, okay, we've already got a point here and a point here <laughs> in two... <laughs> in both the areas that we haven't uh, picked. Okay, wonderful. So we can still use uh, other things. We're not locked into this. Um, but let's let's try and spec it out for diplomacy as much as possible. So what have we got? Diversion, divert people's attention, change a, su change a subject, or avoid questions. Translate all kinds of documents and conversations in foreign languages. That could be interesting. Uh, express your grasp of the geopolitical situation, nation's interest, and diplomatic relations. Convince people with the sheer force of your will and your attitude. That is good. Uh, and adopt the appropriate behavior for every social situation. Also used to formulate flattery or veiled insults. Okay. What was the uh, erudition? There we go. Uh, benefit from a sound cultural background in the arts, geography, and history. Okay. So it's just being knowledgeable about that sort of stuff. Okay. So this one. Uh, I've got three points available. Four points before level two. Reduces the effort points by three. And I have seven. Okay. I think I sort of understand how this works. Um, I mean, this seems mighty important. So I'm going to go ahead and dump all of my points straight into that. That just, that sounds like so much more important than everything else in the diplomat tree. So, there we go. Well, I've devoted myself to the interests of France to the best of my abilities. A few years ago, I had a brush with some of your fellow countrymen. Counter-revolutionaries, I'd imagine. Exactly. They got away. Thanks to a little diversion I came up with to keep the sans culottes away. Believe me, they came close to adorning the walls of the catacombs of Paris. So that young French diplomat was you? The mercy you showed the agents of the Queen roused the admiration of the court. Few would have let them leave France alive. Duchess, I'm surprised that anyone still remembers. Well, they say I have the memory of two people. But please, call me Emily. Hmm. Fine, Emily. That's Tell a me. weird thing to I say. I was actually helped on that case by my mother. You wouldn't know her by any I chance. I have the memory of well, two Fury, people. We've already met. You do remember me, don't you? Ah. Uh, not at all, so lie to her. Or just not at all. I'm not going to lie to her. She seems nice so far. Please excuse me, madam. I'm sure we've met before, but I don't remember where. Hmm. I appreciate your honesty, even if it's not very flattering for me. I imagine that with your beauty, madam, it's the first time a man hasn't remembered your face. Well, I wow. must say, you make up for yourself <laughs> okay. rather elegantly. You charm Please you. stop torturing me. I'm completely at your mercy. Where have we met? Okay, that Three line is dead. Ago, I'm completely at your no, mercy. Sorry. She'd have walked off remember. by now. In the office of William Pitt. Remember? No? I am so sorry, Emily, but I really don't remember you. Let's drop it, Louis. It doesn't matter. Right, time to go to the manor. Opportunities. Your skills allow you to discover hidden details. Select the object that is most suggestive of the situation in order to discover them. Opportunities do not consume effort points. To access the skill required for the situation, you just need to have unlocked it. Hidden details. Se select the object that is most suggestive of the situation. Not sure entirely what that means. Oh. Lips or necklace? What? No, surely that. I ask her a question, she answers okay. with another. Is she playing with me? Oh boy. Lots of lots of tutorials. Personality. Each person you meet on the island has their own personality, which makes them vulnerable to skills certain skills and immune to others. Exploiting their oh watch. Watch every fucking person be immune to the thing I dumped all my skill points into. Um, exploiting their personality is crucial to achieve your personal goals. Skills used against immunities will not succeed and leave you exhausted. Meanwhile, exploited vulnerabilities will give you one effort point back. Okay, what's exhaustion? Push the back button to access your menu pages. Nice. So, uh, so yeah, so things like uh, knowledge of the geopolitical climate is actually going to be useful. I was reading that going like... What? Why would that ever matter? But I guess it's for people that care about that. So you can engage them in conversation and uh, befriend and get information from them. Okay. Emily, please excuse my immunity. Insisting, you immunity still to logic. About okay. My Do you know her? You'll see, Louis. Everybody here knows Sarah de Richet. I know a few people that are immune to logic. 
I don't it know hurts to talk to them. Like this, Emily, but you're connected to my mother one way or another. And if I can believe my vision, you don't have much of a place in her heart. Oh my god, there's more talents. You obtain talents when carrying out certain actions. Remember to review their unlock conditions and effects as they offer very interesting improvements. Review all talents in the dedicated tab in the menu. Okay, I need to look at the menu. Menu, pardon me. Uh, map, okay. So we just came from the left. Character, okay, that's where we do our level ups. Conviction, is logic here? Where's logic? Ah, oh, there's logic, okay. Talents, what are these? I've already got half of this. Uh, diplomatic mastery. Time given for opportunities is increased by 50%. Okay, reach level 3 in diversion and level 2 in etiquette and conviction. Okay. Okay, so it's just like you'll get maybe a few of these from... Uh... Oh, no. Indiscreet. Using vigilance costs you one extra effort point, but you gain a skill point in questioning. And that's from failing five confrontations. Oh no. Is vigilance something that I'll be using? Maybe not. Okay. <laughs> oh, you gain a skill point in conviction. That's good. But, hmm. Okay, this is these ones are good. These ones will happen just from succeeding. Because I I'm a god gamer, I'll have you know. Do I know that symbol? I swear I've seen that symbol somewhere before. Huh. That's gonna piss me off now. I swear this one's seductive. Hmm. Okay. Traits, what are these? Charismatic presence. One skill for you've always been charismatic. Uh, oh, we got this in the sort of prologue thing. You trusted your mother, which gave me a point in psychology. Interesting. Inventory. Laws of Gallantry. A play that might first appear trivial, but is, in reality, an informed analysis of the codes of polite society. Is there anything I can do with this? It doesn't seem like I can actually use it, so maybe it's a quest item? Or I can use it to bargain with someone or something? Emily's handkerchief... My bloodstain, her initials. Mortimer's invitation. Dear Monsieur de Richet, I am writing to you to express my embarrassment regarding the situation in which I find myself. As you probably know, I had invited your mother, Sarah de Richet, to join me on my island several weeks ago. We had projects in common regarding your order. Her stay was going smoothly until yesterday when your mother suddenly disappeared. I do not want to worry you, but I would like you to join me as soon as possible so we can shed some light on this mystery. Please accept, sir, the expression of my highest consideration. Yours sincerely, Lord William Mortimer, Marquis of Westfordshire. Okay. Golden Elixir. Cures negative alterations. Carmelite Water. Next skill use is free. Okay. Royal Jelly. Restore two effort points. Devil's Thorn. Temporarily reveals the immunities and vulnerabilities affecting a dialogue choice. Okay. And what about down in the right here? Collector coins. Lost coins in Lord Mortimer's Manor. So that's probably just collectible collectibles that don't actually mean anything. Okay. This is cool. I I'm I can see myself getting very into this now. There was something. Oh yeah, here. What was this? Uh, 